Hello everyone. Welcome to Clear IAS. In today's video, we will be discussing about the biosphere reserves in India. I am Ujwala Pulela, an educator at Clear IAS. Introduction. Biosphere reserves come under the IUCN category 5 protected areas. They are established for the protection of larger natural habitats. Along with the flora and fauna of the region, human communities inhabiting the area are also given protection here. Previously, we have seen in the videos regarding the important national parks and wildlife sanctuaries in India. These are established specifically for the protection of wildlife and the human activities here are mostly restricted. Whereas in the case of biosphere reserves, human communities inhabiting these areas are also given protection. Also, another fact to remember here is National parks come under the IOCN Category 2 protected areas, whereas the biosphere reserves come under the IOCN Category 4 protected areas. They serve three important functions. So, biosphere reserves have the following three important functions. That is conservation of biodiversity, economic development that is ecologically sustainable, and supporting the research, monitoring, education and information exchange. So this is a picture representing the biosphere reserve. So as we can see, the biosphere reserve is divided into three zones. The first one is the core area, the second one is the buffer zone and third one is the transition area. The core area is the central part of the biosphere reserve where no human activity is allowed and it is mainly used for the conservation purposes. Whereas, the zone surrounding the core area is known as the buffer zone. Here, limited human activity is allowed, which is mainly used for research and educational purposes. The outermost zone is the transition area, where higher human activity is allowed and a cooperation with the local communities is maintained. List of Biosphere Reserves in India Nilgiris Nanda Devi Nokrek, Great Nicobar, Gulf of Mannar, Manas, Sundarbans, Simlipal, Dibru Shaikova, Dehang Dibang, Pachmarhi, Kanchanzonga, Agastya Malai, Achanakmar Amarkantak, Kutch, Cold Desert, Sesha Chalam Hills, and Panna. Nilgiris. It was the first biosphere reserve in India and was established in 1986. The name Nilgiris means Blue Mountains. It is located in the Western Ghats and comprises the areas of Tamil Nadu, Kerala and Karnataka. Nanda Devi. It lies in the Western Himalayan mountains in the state of Uttarakhand. It includes the national parks of Nanda Devi and Valley of Clark. It is tagged as a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1988. Nokrek The Nokrek Biosphere Reserve is located in Meghalaya. It got designated as Biosphere Reserve in 2009. It is mostly covered by evergreen forests. Shifting cultivation is the primary economic activity of the local community here. Great Nicobar it is located here. It incorporates the two national parks, namely Campbell National Park and Galatia National Park. A large part of the Great Nicobar Island is encompassed by this biosphere reserve. It was included in the list of UNESCO's Man and Biosphere Program in 2013. Gulf of Mannar It is one of the richest coastal regions and is the first marine biosphere reserve in Southeast Asia. It is located in Tamil Nadu. The chief inhabitants here are Markayers who are engaged in fisheries. It was recognized by UNESCO in 2001. Manas 
Manas Biosphere is located in the state of Assam. Manas was declared as a biosphere reserve in 1989. It is named after the Manas River which flows here. Sundarbans It is the largest mangrove forest in the world and is spread over India and Bangladesh. It is named after the mangrove tree named Sundari which is found here. It is included in the World Network of Biosphere Reserves from 1989. Sundarbans are present in West Bengal. Simlipal Simlipal Biosphere Reserve is situated in Orisha. It was declared a biosphere reserve in 1994. Simlipal derives its name from Simul tree which is present here. Since 2009, it has been a part of UNESCO's network of biosphere reserves. The Brusaikova The biosphere reserve is situated in the state of Assam. It was designated as a biosphere reserve in 1997. The famous wetland Maguri Motapung Wheel is situated in this reserve. It is bounded by Brahmaputra, Lohit and Dibru rivers. Dihang Dibang It was designated as a biosphere reserve in 1998. This biosphere reserve is situated in the state of Arunachal Pradesh. The Mauling National Park and Dibang Wildlife Sanctuary are a part of this biosphere reserve. Pachmarhi it is located in the state of Madhya Pradesh. It derives its name from two words namely Panch and Marhi which stand for the famous Pandava caves which are located here. It was recognized by UNESCO in the year 2009. Kanchenjunga Kanchenjunga Biosphere Reserve is located in Sikkim. Mount Kanchenjunga, the world's third highest peak is situated here. It was included in the UNESCO's World Network of Biosphere Reserves in 2018. Agastya Malay Agastya Malay Biosphere Reserve is spread across the states of Kerala and Tamil Nadu. It was established in 2001. It got included in UNESCO's World Network of Biosphere Reserves in 2016. This biosphere reserve is spread across the states of Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh. It was established in the year 2005. It was designated in UNESCO's World Network of Biosphere Reserves in 2012. Coal Desert Coal Desert Biosphere Reserve is located in the state of Himachal Pradesh. It was declared as a biosphere reserve in 2009. It is known for the conservation of snow leopard species. Sesha Chalam Hills Sesha Chalam Biosphere Reserve is located in the state of Andhra Pradesh. It is Andhra Pradesh's first biosphere reserve. It was designated as a biosphere reserve in 2010. It has large reserves of red sandalwood trees. Panna Panna Biosphere Reserve is situated in the state of Madhya Pradesh. Ken River flows through this reserve. It was notified as a Biosphere Reserve in 2011. It was included in the UNESCO's Man and Biosphere Program in 2020. So that was a short video regarding the Biosphere Reserves in India. I hope it could help you in some way. Thank you and please subscribe to our channel Clear IS.